Good evening and welcome. On behalf of Corey and Becca, let me say a word of a special thanks to you for being here on behalf of their families as well. Some of you have gone to great lengths to be a part of this evening and they are so grateful. This evening has been in the works and in planning, of course, for several months, but really for many years. For their parents and their families have been praying for them for that long. They would meet the right person, and they did. It's coming up quick, the time's coming. It's really happening. Um, I guess the nerves starting to kick in a little bit. <laughs> and so we come to celebrate that together. Three years ago, they began dating, a blind date, Molly arranged. Uh, about to get married, so, but I'm, I'm ready to marry Becca and spend the rest of my life with her. It wasn't long before they were sure this was someone special. It was a fainting incident at a concert when she fainted and he sort of caught her, and at that moment they realized this is something unique and special. I, Corey, take you, Becca. I, Corey, take you, Becca. To be my wife. To be my wife. I, Becca, take you, Corey. To be my husband. To be my husband. And I promise. And I promise. Before God and these witnesses. Before God and these witnesses. To be your loving and faithful wife. In plenty and in want. In plenty and in want. In joy and in sorrow. In joy and in sorrow. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. As long as we both shall live. As long as we both shall live. As long as we both shall live. Before God and in the presence of this congregation, Corey and Becca have made their solemn vows to each other. It is my pleasure to proclaim that they are now husband and wife. Corey, you may kiss your bride. Would you turn and face this congregation? Ladies and gentlemen, it is my pleasure to be the very first one to ever say these words. May I introduce to you Mr. and Mrs. Corey Allen. so very proud of Becca and Corey and look forward to many years of happiness for them. Becca and Corey, my advice to both of you is to be true to each other always. Married life is an adventure and you embark on that adventure together today. Corey, you are the man that I hope would come into Becca's life. I know that you will love her and nurture her and be there for her when needed but also give her the freedom to be Becca when the time calls for her. So here we are, three years after you first met and now you're married. I love both of you very, very much, and I wish you a fulfilling and wonderful. 